Hi guys, Chris B here, and it's been two years since I bought this uh, Alto TS 415, and uh, I've made some uh, blogs and videos about this when I recently got this machine, and uh, it's been a while since I've uploaded the content for uh, all of my subscribers. So uh, today, I'll be uh, sharing a very interesting uh, uh, vlog for uh, each and every one of my subscribers. Okay. Now is the moment that I would like to uh, share with each and every one what's inside this Alto TS415. Let's get the spec sheets out of the way and let's go ahead and tear this one down. I'll just try to uh, open the back panel. We'll have uh, it exposed and then we'll see if we can uh, check the uh, insides. Now, full disclosure to all of my subscriber that uh, the purpose or the intent of this video is uh, for us to be able to determine if uh, Alto TS-415 or Alto itself have learned its lesson that uh, they really have to uh, step up their uh, uh, build quality, especially when it comes to the tweeter inside the Alto TS-415. Now, please don't get me wrong, uh, Alto has made uh, significant uh, uh, strides and uh, impact in the PA uh, industry. And uh, the Alto TS3 uh, series has been uh, selling like uh, hot, hot cakes uh, before. However, because of the issue with the Twitter, um, some users were uh, discouraged and ended up selling their units and uh, others ended up having their devices repaired and uh, replacing it with a another brand from the brand of like uh, JBL or uh, uh, other brands that's capable of handling the Twitter capability of the old model now for this one what I did to uh, open the back is simply remove all of the screws found here and uh, please do not do this at home okay um, if you are not sure on what you're doing do not do this at home okay so uh, all of the screws at the sides have been removed okay and then I did not remove the other screws here and then all you have to do is to carefully move this one out you see the knobs you can use it okay like that okay so you can uh, simply open the back okay now moment of truth I'll go ahead and share the insides now oh wow the speaker cone have been upgraded and it uh, looks really nice so uh, good job Alto for uh, upgrading the cone speaker inside the Alto TS-415. Now, for the moment of truth, let's take a peek at the Twitter and see if there's any difference. There you see, guys. That's the new Twitter of our Alto TS-415 they've definitely upgraded this uh, tweeter uh, from my recollection for the Alto uh, TS315 series it's not like this it's a very small tweeter and that kind of tweeter is really cheap cheap not because of the price but cheap because it looks horrible it looks something that you can really buy off the shelf or somewhere else with a different brand for a very cheap price like 20 30 dollars something like that so i'm not familiar with this uh twitter or this brand it just says here jl so maybe if we have uh, some subscribers out here who can uh, provide some more information about that kind of Twitter that they've used. But uh, overall, 
As I've mentioned before, it's been uh, two years and uh, I'm uh, really satisfied with this machine. This has really served its purpose. I've used this at home for uh, two years now and I've also used this um, in uh, one of our business in our canteen here in the Philippines. So I got two speakers and uh, the one that's being used in the canteen uh, it's being utilized daily and still performs perfectly fine. I have no qualms, I don't have any issues so far. Everything works perfectly. Also, one, one more thing to note, when I uh, first vlog about this Alto TS415, is that I mentioned that I did not really um, notice any difference or much difference with the equalizer for this device. Uh, but today, I would like to uh, uh, provide an update that uh, it appears that the equalizer for this device is working. I've noticed the difference now when it comes to DJ, to live, to equalizer off, or custom via app. Before, when they launched this product, it doesn't come with, come with an app, but now it does. So uh, that's an added value for this. And another thing that I've mentioned in my previous blog is that whenever you pair or set this one up, it has a voice. It will tell you that it's pairing or it's already connected. And if you don't like to have that uh, feature enabled for some reason, you'll just have to uh, press and hold the pair and the stereo link together and that voice will automatically deactivate. All right, I'm hoping that uh, you guys like my video. It's been a while and I would like to uh, continue sharing more videos here for the Alto TS415. Please consider liking and subscribing to our channel so that I can create more contents for you. Thanks everyone and have a great day.